Let's use the assistant in Minitab 17 to find out which passengers were most likely to survive the sinking of the Titanic. In this worksheet, we have the survival counts for first class female passengers, first class males, second and third class females, and second and third class male passengers. A good first step with any data set is to visualize it with a graph. The assistant is an interactive menu that guides you through performing and interpreting your analysis. Select Assistant, Graphical Analysis, then choose the graph you need. The Assistant's decision tree helps you choose the right graph based on your objective. In this case, we want to compare data across categories, so a pie chart is a good choice. Press the Pie Chart button and select the appropriate category and summarized value columns. Minitab produces a table of summary statistics with details about the data, as well as a summary report, which shows the percentage of survivors for each category. Blue represents the percentage of each passenger group that survived. The graph indicates that female passengers in first class had the best odds of surviving. Over 97% of these passengers survived, compared to only 34% of first class male passengers. Females also fared better among second and third class passengers, with 60% surviving. Men without first class tickets had the worst odds of making it off the ship. Only 16% lived. Graphs indicate what the data show. A hypothesis test can confirm it. If you don't know which test to use, the assistant can help. The assistant presents three possible objectives for hypothesis tests. Since we have divided the passengers into four groups, the objective here is to compare more than two samples. But which of these four tests is right? Click Help Me Choose for guidance. The assistance decision tree continues to guide you to the correct analysis. We know we have attribute data, and we want to compare percentages in outcome categories so the chi-square test for association is appropriate. We already have summarized data in our worksheet, and the outcomes are rows. We have two outcomes and four x values. Select the appropriate columns to complete the dialog box. The assistant produces a report card, a diagnostic report, and a summary report that gives you the test results without a lot of statistical terminology. You don't need a statistical background to understand this output. The report clearly reveals that there are statistically significant differences in the percentages of survivors across the four categories. The percentage profiles chart shows the observed proportions of survivors. Again, you can see that a greater proportion of women survived than men. The chart of percent difference between observed and expected counts shows which groups had survival rates that were unexpectedly high, like first class women, or low, like second and third class men. To include this graph in a report or presentation, just right click on it to send it to Microsoft Word or PowerPoint. The analysis clearly shows that being a woman in first class dramatically increased your chances of survival. Whether or not you would have survived the Titanic, you have survived this analysis. You have seen how Minitab's assistant can help you visualize data with a graphical analysis and confirm the significance of your results with a hypothesis test. To see what else Minitab 17's assistant can do for you, or to download a free 30-day trial of Minitab, visit minitab.com.